What's up, guys? This is You Do It Here. Uh, playing a little Battlefront. This is a recap of a game I had uh, I last night. Uh, this first game, I picked up an ATST and used it for 99% of the game. Got uh, missed my kills. Ended up going 19 and 2. I took an approach here where I stay back and treat this as artillery instead of getting in the middle of it and lasting for only about a minute. So we ended up losing a control point, uh, but we defended and, and uh, won. So the targeting on this is a little tough. I, uh, I'm able to do it, but I have to be really careful with the control. Now by moving around like this I'm trying to use line of sight and keep some obstacles in my way since I'm a little tall I stand out and if anybody's trying to shoot an eye on at me I would expect that the structures in front of me will block it, prevent them from getting a clean shot on me. I mean, look at this. I, you know, I'm I'm getting people with this. This is a, it's an area effect, and when you hit the ground or a structure next to them, you're killing them. Look, I just wrecked three people in a matter of a couple of seconds. Yeah, it's starting to get a little bit more intense here. The airspeeders are coming after me a little bit more frequently. This is a good shot here. He was already down. You know, it does about 40 damage each kill, <laughs> each hit. That knocked him right out. I think at the end of the game, I ended up getting uh, two, two vehicle kills from this. If I uh, if I was a better shot with the missile, I would have had a had some more.
I get this guy again. Half Dragon 79. This guy thinks he's being sneaky. He wants to get a hit in on me. He's coming in and I uh, throw a missile at him. Now he's got it to hurt. <laughs> yeah. Now I get to keep uh, at the ground battle. See, so I'm a little close here because they're uh, locking in on me. I should have backed up some. Comes a speeder. Trying to keep them honest. This guy was good. Are you kidding me, Kamikaze? Really? This is one of my better games with sniping. I think I went 14-0 or 19-0 in this game. It was just a lot of uh, line of sight, staying behind something and trying to pick people off using a DLT 19X. This was a lot of fun. I'm starting to get the hang of the weapon, the timing, uh, leading the target.
taking hold of a control point. And that uh the medic droid helps out a lot too. What can do? I can put that down and it heals me up. And also uh, refreshes my ion. And it uh, came in handy when I uh, destroyed a ATST. This guy here with a pulse cannon. He wants to get me in the worst way. So the objective of the control point, you know, you, you want to put as many soldiers as you can inside a control point. Uh, but I'm eating the team by picking off a lot of them uh, from afar. And I think uh, it helped in this game. We'll have to see because I forget the details. Capture is underway. So the objectives moves further away. Um, you know, the control points keep moving away as you're taking them over. So here I'm trying to reposition myself uh, to contribute more to picking off people from a distance. So this guy sees me, he starts shooting at me. Um, I knew I should have got out my eye on and pointed it to him sooner because he may not have uh, pulled away so quickly. Here's a guy with a pulse cannon. He's uh, got it in for me. Turns out this guy was a tough player at the time. I have to remember what his name was. Top player killed. Now this is the reason why when I was in the ATST in the previous game that I stayed far back. Because you notice there, I couldn't get a line of sight on them. Now somebody else closer probably could have, but the point is, is that in ATST, you're really vulnerable. You take two shots from an ion and you're going to be dead. Get a thermal impact grenade, that'll uh, could finish you off. So I stayed back with the ATST. Forty damage. So yeah, you got to hit it uh, two and a half times. Our forces are capturing a control point. That shot there was just horrible. I I shot too late. Headshot. Here we go. Control point capture is 
I mean, if you notice, <laughs> I'm at the uh, top. Uh, I think it's a sniper or targeting. My trait card that gives me uh, extra damage when you're at level three. You can see the the bottom left when I zoom out. I don't see why I'm not getting him. We've taken over a control point. I'm trying to bring out my iron because I'm like, oh man, look, I can get the kill on this one. There we go. There we go. Yes. Hey, you hear me? So now he's on. You hear me? Yep, unfortunately. Oh man, I got a, <laughs> I got a badass game going on right now. I'm ten and zero right now. Nice. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm, I'm doing a uh, sniping. So you're being a bitch then. I am. Keep getting headshots. I'm recording the f this too. This is going on YouTube. I'm in a heroes versus villains game right now. Yeah, your game is full, Matteo. Is it? Yep. That's what it's telling me. Yeah, you know, the same bullshit you did last time. Because, uh, I thought there was, like, still, uh, Uh, one space on our side and two on theirs. You guys might be getting feedback because I don't have my headphones on. Chronic. you, Denver. Pew pistol. Fucking got him. Square in the head with the smart rocket. Headshot bonus, bitch. Better f***ing run, Dengar. Like a f***ing boy running away from me. Yeah, just killed Bosk, piece of shit. That's right. <laughs> I'm playing with uh, Donald Trump 555. <laughs> <laughs> Donald Trump's a badass, too. Who knew? Probably his, his son. <laughs> yeah, Baron. When you're done with your game, John, let me know and I'll just back out of this shit. I will. Is that the steak? It's something. Yeah, boop. Yeah, you might want to back down there. Dude. Oh, they got a hero pickup on their side. That sucks. Well, 18 and 0.
Damn, nothing but sniping. All right, game is done. Oh, okay, it's going to take me a minute to back out. Yeah. I'm going to re-invite you, Matt, because... 